Hey y'all and welcome to today's video. I am over the moon because I have the new Lunar Beauty Siren Sunset Collection y'all. We've got the lips, we've got the palette. I am super excited. We're going to swatch everything. I really want to show you the special shades in this palette. I want to show you the shift of the multi-chrome and the duo chromes. I want to do lip swatches. I want to play with this palette. We have beautiful, cool tones. I want to know, is this the Lunar Beauty that I love? We're going to find out today. Let's jump into it. <music> getting started this is the siren sunset collection from lunar beauty lunar beauty did send me this collection had they not sent this to me in pr i would have bought the full collection myself i love lunar beauty i have been a customer of theirs for so long because i think they make amazing amazing products and i really like kind of the overall aesthetic of the brand they just make products that appeal to me and I want to talk about the items individually and kind of swatch everything and then we'll then we'll try it all on. So let's start with this palette Siren Sunset. The beautiful Lunar Beauty packaging that I know and love from the brand. The beautiful mermaid on the front with the raised moon. The packaging for Lunar Beauty is always really expensive feeling in my opinion. Like it's nice. It It's nice. And then we have this beautiful cool toned color story inside. I want to show you close up and swatches of this so that you can kind of see how it all swatches out. Sometimes I think it can be helpful just to see the shades like swatched on the arm. Of course, the true test of a shadow is how it applies, how it looks on the eyes. That's how I'm wanting to know if a shadow is good. But swatches can be super fun. I I'm excited for these cool tones. Cool tones are so in right now. Like we're seeing cool tone, cool tone, cool tone. And I am loving the mix of the neutrals with the colorful shades. I love neutrals. I love color. Nine times out of 10, I'm going for the colorful option. But for those times that I want to play with some browns, I have that in here. So I'm really, really looking forward to playing with this palette, not just today, but going forward because I can see myself wearing these shades a lot. Green is my absolute favorite color, so I love that we have some greens in here, but I do also wanna show you some swatches that I just took on my iPhone because I really want to be able to show you in different lighting and things, the shifts in these shadows. I know that Lunar Beauty has put multi-chrome, duochrome in here. I think there's also a shade that's described as a like multi-chrome sparkle shade, something like that. So I want to just make sure I can really, really show you those because I, I think that's fun. I'm, I'm excited to see Lunar Beauty dipping their toes into the multi-chrome world but yeah we're definitely going to create looks with this i love the theming i know that this is the last like launch for lunar beauty of the year so kind of like their holiday release halloween release all the vibes that makes me kind of sad but i understand you know like we're almost done with october it's time to wrap it up i'm just really looking forward to putting that on let's talk about the liquid lipsticks so at the end of the video, I will do lip swatches so that you can see how the lips look with the full look. I love the Lunar Beauty Liquid Lipstick Formula. I bought them for the first time. Love them so much. I went on the site and ordered all the shades they had available. It's that level of I love this liquid lipstick formula. It's so good. It's a liquid lipstick in that it's a long wear but it's not a liquid lipstick and that you feel like SpongeBob when he gets out of the ocean, you know, that <gasps> no water type of feeling. I am actually wearing right now the shade, let's see, Pink Pearl. I, this is my type of shade. I love a mauve tone. I do have olive warm leaning skin and I just feel like the contrast, a mauve contrast my skin and I just 
love it. Anyways, we will lip swatch all of these because there are three that go with this collection. Now, my affiliate code with Lunar Beauty is Heather. If you ever want to shop the site, get a little discount, you can use my code. You definitely don't have to, but I will also put that in the description box. I will put a link to everything I talk about down in the description box. Definitely check there if you're curious, but I'm going to put down an eyeshadow primer. I'm going to zoom y'all in nice and close, and we are going to create a look with this palette. See if this is the Lunar Beauty I know and love. Okay, y'all, I am primed and ready for shadow. And don't play with me. <laughs> don't play with me. You know I'm going in with this green and Ariel first, okay? We're going in with the green, and then we're going to go in with Alluring. I know you saw the swatches. I don't want to swatch this until after I've put it on my eyes because I want to I wanna go into this with no, no thoughts in my head. <laughs> so I want to use Ariel and then I want to use Alluring. I love green and purple together so much. And it's been a minute before since I've done green and purple. And I want to play. I want to play with Ariel. So I'm going to pick this up on my brush. I will list the brushes that I use down in the description box. But right now I'm using one from Lunar Beauty. And then I'll also probably be using my Singe brushes as well. So I'm just going to start off with this green kind of in this front part of my socket. So I do have deep set eyes. I'm going to bring my shadow up to kind of lift, lift the eye right in here. So I'm bringing up that green a little higher than maybe, than maybe is typical. <laughs> And I'm going to just kind of buff. I can go back and blend more in a minute. But I just kind of want to get that shade on right there. And then we're going to put the alluring shade right out here. Okay, so now, like I said, I have my singe brush. And I'm just going to press this on. I'm going to pick up a little at a time on my brush. This is a very dark color. And I'm putting it on the lid right here. And then I'm also putting it like in the outer part of my socket. And I'm going to bring it out a little bit. I just want to do a little at a time so that this shade doesn't get away from me. You know, I don't want to like end up with it where I don't want it. So I'm going to put it in this outer part of my socket. And then I'm going to bring it out a little bit as well, again, just to kind of like lift and open up my deep set eyes. So a little at a time and then just lightly, lightly, carefully blending. Okay, I really like these shades next to each other. I'm going to do some blending in a minute. Right now, I just want to kind of get the shades on, visualize where I'm taking the look, and I'll make sure they blend together in a bit. I want to go in with this deep blue, though, on the lower lash line. I want to take deep C because it looks so pretty. And you know what? Let me just, let me just pick up a little and... Put this on the lower lash line. Let me, I'm like, can y'all even see me? Oh, I know you can see that blue. That's beautiful. Okay. Lunar Beauty coming through with these beautiful, beautiful, colorful mattes. That makes me really happy. And you know, of course, I'm using the colorful shades first off. I want the full fantasy mermaid vibe today. Siren, sorry, not mermaid. I feel like sirens are a little more violent. <laughs> which, which you know, that's, that's more of the vibe I'm going for today. We can always do the neutrals another day because they look beautiful too. But purple, green, blue, hmm. Not, not a bad way to start my day. It's eight in the morning for me and I'm into it.
Okay, I'm really, really into this so far, but I do wanna buff and blend a little bit, especially right in here, just something to kind of buff. I wanna use Shell. I think this is going to be my best bet. So I'm gonna do Shell, I'm gonna buff that here. And then under the lower lash line, I thought maybe with this blue, maybe just a tiny bit of mystery to kind of buff and blend that out. And then we are gonna play with the sparkle. All right, so I'm just barely grazing my skin with that shade Shell, just along the like edge of where I stopped with the shadows just barely touching my skin, just a tiny bit of shadow on my brush to help me kind of like get, get a little more of a blend here. And I'm just going to be careful because I definitely don't want to kind of like over blend and have it look messy. So I'm just gonna take my time lightly like this around and for the lower lash line I will be grabbing whoops, whoops, a smaller brush going into that shade mystery and kind of same concept just lightly fading it out it's time to bring in a multi-chrome I want to use temptress this is lunar beauty's first multi-chrome if I am remembering correctly and I have to use, like I have to use it. We're testing the palette. We have a multi-chrome. Let's test it. This is Temptress. So I'm seeing different shades of blue in this one. I'm seeing purple. I'm going to pick this up on my brush. I'm gonna spray my brush with a little setting spray. I like spraying my shimmers, my duochromes, my metallics, my multi I like, I just like it. Gives me a little intensity. So I'm gonna spray my brush now that I have the shadow on it. And we'll see. We'll see, we'll see how Lunar Beauty did with this one. Okay, so with the multi-chrome, we are gonna see the shift, the strongest, if I can give it a lot of surface area to cover. The more room you give it, the more you're going to see that shift. So instead of trying to fit a ton of these shimmers on my eye, I am going to just put this from inner part of my lid all the way to where we put that matte on the outer part of the lid. And I'm going to bring it up high. Like my socket is here. I'm gonna bring it all the way up. I'm pressing first and then I'm lightly blending. Okay, I know you saw in the swatches, but I feel like at this angle in the mirror, you can also see how on my eye, it looks blue. But then if you look in the mirror, it looks purple. I like, that's fun. I don't know. I just wanna show you the shift. I think it's fun. I think it's fun. And it also like turning to the side, different angles, like I'm into it. As I'm going about my day to day, in and out of different rooms, different lighting in the sun, in the house, like I'm gonna see those reflex and it's gonna make me happy. So I want to, I want to play with uh, something fun on the inner corner. So I think what we'll do is do Water Nymph. I think that's gonna be really, really pretty with our look. So I'll pick that up on my brush, I'll spray it, and we'll pop it right here. Okay, I am going to put this right here on the inner corner. I'm just pressing it on, and then I'm going to blend a little bit, just kind of wrapping it on top of the blue on the lower lash line, just in this little area, and then just up a little bit here. So it's this really pretty like blue green kind of iridescent type of shade like this. Yeah, I would say like more of an iridescent type of duochrome. I'm going to throw on eyeliner. I'm going to throw on a false lash because I feel like a siren needs a lash. 
and then I'll come back. We'll see how the look comes together. We'll do lip swatches of the liquid lipsticks and I'll share my first impression thoughts with y'all. All right, y'all, here is the finished look. Before we talk more about the palette, I do want to insert the lip swatches for you because I did swatch all three shades. I did use some of my Lunar Beauty lip liners with these shades, so I will put those down in the description box, along with links to the other things that I'm wearing, like my glowy skin, my top, if you're curious, my lash, the eyeliner I used. I'm wearing the uh, Lunar Beauty blush and highlight today too. I will put all of that in the description box just in case you are curious. Let's talk about the palette because the lipsticks, I already know I love those. Like these are just new shades to me, not new formulas. The Lunar Beauty palette, I think this is great. I expect Lunar Beauty to put out great shadows and they do. These mattes are pigmented, but they were easy to blend. I didn't have any problems there. I, I think this multi-chrome is multi-chrome. It is shifting. Same with the duochrome. I'm really excited to see new formula from Lunar Beauty. Never done a multi-chrome formula before, so I was super excited about that. Of course, I love the packaging, and for me, this, this is cool tones that I'm super into. I'm looking forward to wearing my siren look today, um, you know, to be a homeschool mom. But I do have plans to go out later this evening. So the makeup, it will get to get out of the house and I'm excited about that. I hope whatever you are doing, you are having an amazing day. Please do subscribe. I have lots of videos coming, like so many videos coming. I have videos I've already filmed, videos on my list to film, so please do subscribe, stick around, and I will see you then. Bye!